Hello everyone, peace of the Lord with G uh, uh, Jesus Christ with everybody. You know, uh, uh, this guy you saw in the picture here, he's talking that the reason of every lie in, uh, over the Christians and the Jew and the Hindu is the Satan. First, let us see who is a Satan first, and then we can, we can let us give a definition for the Satan. This is Sahih Muslim, the book of Al-Qiyamah, resurrection, and heaven and fire. This is the name of the book. The chapter name, the, the, the work of Satan trying to de deceive you by sending his men and his soldiers. This was the sub chapter name. Hadith number 5035. Cool. Now, who, what, is, what, is, what the hadith is saying there? This is a very authentic hadith approved by Muslims. Aisha, she was jealous from the Prophet because he was sleeping with all women around. You know, the Prophet, he have a big fan. He's a, he's a superstar. All the women, they want to sleep with him, even, even not the wives. Because in Surah Al-Ahzab, any woman, she can give herself to the Prophet to have sex with her as a gift. Imagine, I like that. Eh? I wish I am him, maybe. You know, a woman, she will knock at my door and say, say what to me, you know, please, please, you know, take me, take me. And I will say, maybe, you know what, I, I, I'm busy because my bed is busy now. Anyway, this is a different story. So according to this story in here, the wife, she was jealous. Muhammad, he said to her, is your Satan came to you? She said, do I have a Satan? He said, every human being have a Satan. She said, including you? He said, including me. But my God helped me and I converted him to Islam. So the Satan of Muhammad converted to Islam. And the video I saw from this guy, you know, said clearly that every human have one companion, one Satan. One companion. Now, according to this, the companion of Muhammad converted to Islam and he became a Muslim. Now, we will see that this good satanic Muslim, he was the one who was playing around with Muhammad, causing him to do bad, filthy stuff. But before we go there, you know, isn't it weird that Satan converted to Islam? You know, isn't it accept the, the logic that Satan, Satan can accept filth? I will agree if, if somebody said to me, well, uh, uh, Satan... He converted to uh, like he like he like people who they are gays, who he like people who they are uh, uh, criminals. He like people because they are doing fair, huh? But Satan accepted Islam. This is mean what? This is mean Satan is not absolute evil. And in the same verse, this guy he talked to, he did talk about you know, it's talking that Satan, he and his people, they are evil, absolute evil. So how does Satan, who is absolute evil, became a good guy and he converted to Islam? The only way to accept this hadith, if the Satan, he is accepting filth, not accepting good. So Islam is filth and this is makes sense. Now, let us continue to show that Islam is filth and Satan, he is perfect fit in Islam. This is a hadith from Sahih al-Bukhari, the book of Tib, medicine, chapter magic and you know magic means black magic always because god don't do magic now five three two one is the hadith number this hadith saying and there's many of them that the prophet was under the control of a black magic bed made by a jewish man over muhammad and even the prophet he used he used uh, uh, to imagine himself having sex with his wives when he never did so this is a very heavy, strong magic over Muhammad. Now I want to ask you, if Muhammad, he said every man he have one companion devil. And we saw from the hadith before, the companion devil of Muhammad became a Muslim. So who is this one? <laughs> Allah says only your companion devil will keep talking to you all your life. Only that one. He's attached to you. This, his job is you. No other one. Now, the prophet, companion, devil, became a Muslim as we showed you from Sahih Muslim. You remember? Just a second ago. Now, who is the one who is talking to Muhammad? He making him under the control of a black magic. And how Allah could not protect Muhammad from the black magic, which means the power of Satan. How Satan was able to control Muhammad. If Muhammad is a good guy. Now, this is a surah, 15 verse number 42. It says, Allah saying, promising. And saying to Satan, that's forever, my servant, no authority shall you, shall do, have, except such as put themselves in. No one, no Satan, can have a power over the believers of Allah. Now, if this is a true, how Muhammad was under the control of the black magic by Satan? How? He was not a good guy? Because in here, he's saying, the good 
people who believe in me for over forever over my servant any one of them you have no authority and you have no power over them this is a proof that Muhammad was a filthy man because if Allah is saying you have no power over them and you cannot you cannot you cannot do anything to them you cannot control them and the hadith we showed you is the hadith saying that Muhammad was controlled by black magic now let us see what the black magic caused to Muhammad Muhammad he used to live in an illusion he is mentally sick the one who live in an illusion he you know he do not know the difference between the truth and the, the imagination or dreaming let us see hadith number 2939 the book of Sahih al-Bukhari the book of a jizya chapter name uh, uh, you know are you going to forgive someone he is a Christian or a Jew if he was under the control of a black magic no, they are questioning if they should forgive a Christian or a Jew if he was controlled by black magic, but they are not questioning their prophet if we should not forget him, forgive him or not. Look at their prophet. In Nabiya, this is Aisha saying, In Nabiya sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, kana suhira, he was under black magic. Hatta kana yukhayilu ilay, until he was imagining that he was doing things, but he never did. Annahu sana'a shay'an, wa lam yasna'ahu. Now let us see what those things they are talking about. It's about having sex with his wives. Now this is Sahih al-Bukhari, hadith, num hadith number 5603. The book of Al-Adab. Uh, you will see in here that the Prophet he used to imagine himself having sex with all his wives, but he never did. Now there is one of two options. Either Muhammad used to go outside and he say, I was having sex with all my uh, uh, 11 or 13 wives but he never did which means he was li li liar just, just like trying to be a hero of sex as usual you know but or he was under the control of the black magic now control of a black magic for me it's false I believe strongly that this guy he is mentally sick he have a problem he have two personality he see things is not true and he live in illusion now until now we will see how many time Muhammad he you know like is it is it a, a real case Muhammad he used to live in illusion or all his life is an illusion and this is will question if he used to see really an angel let us see this is the book of Sunan Durami presentation book hadith number 17 and there you will see that the Prophet wherever he go to do poo poo trees move over him to keep him in shade you know, God, Allah is watching you, Muhammad, doing poo poo, and He's protecting you by tree from the sh by, by the shade. Is is that an illusion? A tree is moving around to keep you in shade when you are doing poo poo. Why? For how long he was doing poo poo? Because the shade of the tree will not move that fast. The tree shade will move in two or three hours. Sound the poo poo of Muhammad was like for twenty hours. Let us continue. See more illusion. This is the book of Sunan al Durami presentation, Hadith number sixteen. The Prophet, he called a tree, invited a tree to Islam, and the tree walked to him and asked him, what do you want, Prophet? And the tree, she said, Shahada, three times. And when she is done, after she converted to Islam, the tree walked back to where she came from. Is that an illusion? Or this is a true? Tree is converting to Islam, now the person in, in, in a, who called himself a doctor, we saw him in the video, he's talking about people who see things is not true, they, they are mentally sick, and he was claiming that this is because of the devil, making them think about things not real. Is that real? Why the tree will convert to Islam? What he have to do with the tree? Allah, he sent him a prophet for trees? Okay, things happened. The person who talk about mentally sick people, you know, we need to see how the prophet used to receive, uh, 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 you know, the message of God he used to hear bells in his head he used to hear noise and he used to see him sometime as a ghost and sometime he used to see him as a man is that an illusion why you're a prophet he don't see him as one thing at in always why he's why he hear this noise and why always he go and like he 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 at his absence he's not he's away from everything and he's his body shaking and his his uh, his uh, his body have a fever why you know why this is happening when the angel he came to Mary according to Quran did did Mary uh, her body shake 
did Mary she see or she hear bells in her ears? She hear noise? Did she see a ghost or she saw someone look like real, something make her happy? She was not scared. She was not scared because angels supposedly they make you feel happy. They don't make you feel scared. They are not Satan. After all of this, to make it short, you know, if this Allah saying, Allah saying, no one have authority over my people who believe in me, how the Satan was able to make Muhammad under the black magic and why Muhammad was seen a lot of things cannot be true if I want to count what those things it's um, no way to count it I need 10, you know, 10 years maybe so we will continue and make the Lord bless you all and make you see the truth Muhammad is not from God he is just a liar it's very clear thank you